All right, this is going to be another fabulous electrical test with my fabulous test rig. Here's my Arco Roto phase right up there on the old garage ceiling, you know. Let's see if it'll boot up here with the old breaker panel. It's all experimental. Whoops. That was wrong. <laughs> yeah. Uh-oh. Yeah. Uh, gotta start the Wildcat leg first. That's this one. That's this here breaker. That boots up the Arco. And this here breaker, this one, boots up the 220 single phase stuff. And, uh, I should spin up that motor over there. So yeah, here's this. Yeah. And we have what I call motor boot up or a FBU. This is what I call full boot up. Yeah, see that's running right there. Yeah, this is exciting or what? See these are my strange electrical connections here. I got vice grips here. And uh, they're connecting these heavy gauge wires, which have what I call loop ends on them, to the motor. And they connect to this, which I call my experimenting lead, which has uh, Jorgensen pony clamps on there. This is a piece of four conductor wire here. It has these Jorgensen ponies. I got four of them. I'm not using the ground one today. I'm only using three of them. Yeah, and uh, this is what I call a piece of uh, dryer cord. That's my single phase rig, and this black uh, tube here that looks like a piece of garden hose is really not. It's a piece of 6 slash 4 SO cord. This stuff is pretty gigantic. Here's my hand. That's my thumb. And, uh, you know, it's about, it's just over an inch in diameter. It's six, here's one of the conductors, actually. This is one of the conductors. That's the Wildcat lead there. That's the one coming out of my uh, roto phase converter. And uh, this is the single phase set up here. You know, the ground lead I'm not using today. This is isolated here. This is all an isolated incident. So yeah, and uh, if you hear any dogs barking, it's my neighbor's dogs. They're, they're, <laughs> they're frantic. They like my experiments. Yeah, these are some heavy wires. This is all just a, like a little insane asylum. This motor here, see, it's actually, it's actually running. Can you see that? This is a fabulous Dar Wang. Fabulous. It's a Dar Wang. And it's running. And here comes a little doggy. Yeah. Okay, so yeah, this has been another fabulous experiment here in Dave's Nuthouse. So yeah. This is my, uh, this is the cable here that holds the juice. You know, this makes the electrical power that uh, runs the stuff in my shop, you know. It's pretty long, you know. Uh, it comes out of the breaker panel over there, which is, this is the breaker panel, you know. It's a big one. And it comes down, this is all, this is all wired to code here. <laughs> this is, this is all a code rig, you know, and uh, it comes down out of the breakers and stuff where I got a jury rig. It goes down the floor over here. It goes all the way up. See, there's two of them here, see? There's two there, see? It, it goes all the way up to the front of the garage. And it wraps around my wife's gardening stuff here. Then it comes back, and it goes back over here on the floor. It comes back around this circle here. And it goes to here, this electrical outlet that I got screwed to this board here. So yeah, this is my experimental station. And that's the uh, fabulous Dar Wang 3 horsepower motor running on my fabulous Arco Roto Phase rotary converter right up there. Yeah! <laughs> Can you see it? It's up there, believe me. That's a little welding I made to hold it up on the wall here. It's just a little welding. You, know, you ought to see this. You should have been here today and put this thing up there. This damn thing weighs about 150 pounds. 
I had to put a pulley on the ceiling up there, way up there, and lift it up with a piece of wire rope. It was pretty exciting. Well, okay. It's been nice visiting with you for now. So, uh, let me uh, shut this stuff down, huh? Yeah. So the motor's on booting. See? Yeah. It's been exciting. Okay. Another successful experiment. Here at the nut house. Alrighty then. Bye bye.